Hello everybody, it's me, Justin Morehouse, in my house again, hosting the Ultimate Sports Quiz with our friends at the TM Group. We're trying to raise a few quid for NHS charities, and if you want to donate, there's going to be links on there and everything, just go to the NHS and just go to the hospital and give them some money if you want, just throw it out, but socially distant. Uh, today, in the Ultimate Sports Quiz, we take a sporting legend and we pit him against somebody from the world of sport in a business sense. Uh, and today, we have got two legends. We've got Director of Sport for Now TV at Sky. It's Nathan Homer. Hello, Nathan. Are you all right? Hey, Justin. How are you doing? I'm going to say, I think you've got one legend and it's not this one. Oh, come on, mate. Come on. I'm hoping I get free Now TV. <laughs> I call you a legend. I'll save myself that tenner a month that I spend on my Now TV subscription for when I'm out and about. Uh, nice to see you, Nathan. Are you, are you self-isolating fine? Are you looking after yourself? Yeah, I'm good. Out in the countryside with the family, so I'm getting plenty of exercise. Good stuff. Well, same as me. You're a man after my own heart. And talking of uh, real legends, uh, he's a man who uh, switched code, speaks two languages, and likes a pint. Uh, that's Jonathan Davis. Hello, Jonathan. Hey, boys. All right. Morning, afternoon. No. Yeah. Do we call you oh, Jonathan Davis OBE? Just do, do you insist on that? Just call me Jiffy. That's fine. All right. <laughs> that's what we'll do. What we're going to do? We're going to. We, you're both competitive. I'm sure. We're going to ask you a question each. We're going to do it like a penalty shootout in football. And all you've oh. got to do is, first thing, heads or tails, Jonathan? Tails. It's a head, I'm afraid. So uh, you lost that one. Do you want to go Start. first or second, Nathan? Oh, I'll go first, see if I can get a few in the net. Put the pressure right. on him. Okay. <laughs> he was never any really good question. under pressure, was he? Then Much. Jonathan's question. All right. In June 2017, climber Alex Honnold made history when he scaled El Capitan, a rock face in Yosemite. His exploits were chronicled in the film Free Solo, but what was unusual about the climb? Uh, it was a free climb, no ropes. Is the right answer. Well done, Nathan. The clue was in the uh, question, wasn't it? 1-0 to you, Nathan. Jonathan. I knew that was. What is the highest possible score in a bowling match? A in bowling ten, match? In Tempting Bowling. Oh. Is it 160? It's not, mate. It's 300. Oh, is it? Well, I, I, I'm not really playing myself. <laughs> I've, I've never got a past 160, that's for sure. <laughs> not me. Uh, what are the five colours, Nathan, of the Olympic rings? Uh, if I get this wrong, I will get shot, given I worked on them for however many years. Uh, blue, green, red, yellow, yeah. and brown. It's black, I'm afraid. Oh, oh I get shot for that. I <laughs> got to look for that. that every single day. Jonathan, uh, which horse is the only three time winner of the Grand National? Oh my God. That's Red Drum, isn't it? <laughs> it certainly is Red Drum, I can't believe it. Nathan, um, since 1977, where has Snooker's World Championship taken place? Uh, the Crucible in Sheffield. That's correct. Jonathan, uh, who holds the women's record for the 100 metre sprint? Oh, uh, no, I can't, I can't get it. It's Flojo, Florence Griffith, <laughs> Joyner, of course. Uh, it's 2-1 to you, uh, Nathan. If you get this one right, I think that's an unassailable lead, isn't it? Which is the highest football ground in England? Ooh. Well, I, th I don't think that's too far. F that's definitely up north. I reckon that might be... Is it Port Vale? It's not. It's West Bromwich Albion. Is it? I'd have gone for over yes. them there. Eh? Wow. 2-1. Uh, Jonathan. Which Englishman, Englishman has managed the most Premier League matches? Um, we had him on our quiz already. He's with Crystal Palace, isn't he? What's his name now? No, he's not. Oh, hold on. One, <laughs> of the not one of the only ones he's not. That's Roy Hudson. That's Roy Hudson, Jonathan. Yeah, uh, which, English, which Englishman? Uh, Red Knapp. Is the right answer. Oh. Uh. That's a good Two one. All. Two all. Okay, the final question uh, for you, Nathan. Which player scored the first Premier League goal in 1992? Oh, God, that's a tough one. Uh, between two, I'm going to go for Brian Dean. 
is correct. Yes, he was well, Brian Dean of Sheffield United. Answer. Good answer, that. <laughs> you need this one, Jonathan. Stadium of Light is home to which English football club? Say it again. The Stadium of Light is the home of which English football club? It's Sunderland. Is the correct answer. It's three all. Oof. This is incredible. All right. Well, we haven't embarrassed ourselves anyway, Nate. That's the best thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say, I'll tell you, that was a very honourable <laughs> point that we shoot out, Scott. I'm happy, I'm happy with that. Which oh, I, had I had negated to get, so I will get that one for you now. <laughs> Solomon one second. <laughs> this is uh, rubbish. Yeah. How many tries did Jonathan Davis score in his I would national know. career? I would know. <laughs> I had a quiz, I had a family quiz, how many caps I had. I, I'm honest to God, I can't remember. I've got to go off Wikipedia now. <laughs> All right, so listen, it's, um, do, you, do you know what? This is an interesting one because you both have got a chance here. Okay, it's a rugby union question. Mm. It's based in Leeds. Oh. Uh, Leeds play at uh, the famous Headingley Stadium. Yep. But what is the capacity of Headingley for rugby? One no. Write it down. Well, I've got a pen. The current capacity. Well, if you've not got a pen, Jonathan, what we'll do is let Nathan write his down. You close your eyes. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. I've changed your mind. It's changed, it's changed your mind. <laughs> I hope nobody screen grabbed this, Jonathan. It looks like you're having a breakdown, mate. All right. Well, I'm ready. <laughs> so if you hold yours up, Nathan. To the screen so we can see it. Don't say it. Okay, now Jonathan, without looking, now keep it held up, Nathan. Keep it held up, Nathan. Je Jonathan, without looking, what do you reckon it is? Uh, 20, 24,000. It's, no, you said 24, he said 20. It's actually brilliantly, mate. 19,700. Nathan, you today's winner. Uh, well done. Oh, on the tie break. Wow. I, well feel done, like, I feel like I've robbed him, given how many times I've been and stood on the terrace there. Although I did watch <laughs> him play a few times, so... <laughs> I know. Well done, you both, you both did very well there. We went to a tiebreaker. The idea is we're going to ask people to chuck a few quid at the NHS. Uh, you've been bro both great competitors. For you, Jonathan, the journey's over. Nathan, we'll see you in the next round. Good luck, Nathan. All right. Good fun. Thanks, Jonathan.